In this video, I'll show you how I made this obelisk trellis. Welcome to my messy garage. We have a miter saw sitting on top of a table saw and a bunch of scrap wood. And we are going to use all three to make the trellis. So I was able to fish out a 2x2 of decent length and I'm using a table saw to split it in half here. And then I'm going to split the half in half again and uh, oops this does not look right we're gonna try again the table saw wasn't set up right these things happen and that's fine that's just what happens when you try and make something sometimes you make a mistake but that's all right Now I am going to rotate all pieces by 90 degrees and run them through just to make sure that they are all square. This is what I have at the end. I use the miter saw to give it a bit of a taper on one end. 15 degrees is a good angle. The picture is pretty self-explanatory in terms of what the whole thing looks like and how it's put together. Um, I wanted a chunkier top so that I can attach a finial on top of it. And I'm going to paint it black to make it look fancy a little bit and all matchy-matchy with my fence which is a two-tone cedar uh, sections, fence sections with black posts. So I have a, like a wooden planter that I'm going to use uh, with the black trellis. I think it's going to match the, the fence. All right. And this is the finished product. Except for the finial, I'm still trying to source one of those. It hasn't been easy this year. I might just stick a pine cone on top of it for now until I find the finial. But uh, it's, it does its job, it's looking good. And that's, that's it, uh, bye for now. I hope you enjoyed this video.